Yo, welcome back to my channel. Listen, as always, I'm so glad that you're here. I'm so glad that you're back. Listen, please be sure to like, subscribe, and to comment, and please be sure to hit that bell notification so that way you can be notified anytime I upload. First off, let me say I want to welcome you to Mark's FTP Talk. What is FTP? FTP is all what I'm about, which is faith, transparency and positivity. Happy first Monday of 2022. Listen, I knew that on this first Monday, I had to get in here and talk to y'all. Listen, this year in 2022, I want you and I to multiply. What does that even mean? So as I was gathering my thoughts around the word multiply for the year 2022, an encounter that I had back in 11th grade came to mind. I remember when I was in 11th grade and I remember my family, we were preparing to go um, hit the road to go to my sister's college graduation. I think it was like two or three hours away. I had to leave school early that day so that I could go meet my family so that we can hit the road. And I remember getting on the bus on my way home and it was like 11 or 12 o'clock. It was like the middle of the day. And I remember there was this older lady who was also on the bus. And she asked me, she said, young man, why are you not in school? And I went on to explain to the lady that the reason why I was not in school was because I was on my way to my sister's graduation. I had to leave early so that my family could hit the road. And I remember the older lady asking me what my sister's degree was in and you know, what was her field. And I remember telling her, and we talked about my sister's graduation a bit. And I would never forget the older lady, she turned the conversation on me and she said, well, what about you? What about your, what do you wanna do for your future? I had no idea what I wanted to do with myself. And I just remember on impulse, I was like, I think I'm called to be a minister of God's word and I want to be a musician that plays jazz. And I remember saying that. I literally remember saying those two things. I want to be a minister of God's word and I want to play jazz. And I would never forget the lady looked at me and she stopped and she said, hmm. And she said, minister, jazz, minister, jazz. And she looked at me and she said, that don't go together. Mm. No. You can't do that. That don't go together. And I would never forget that encounter. And as I began to think about 2022, it amazes me how a lot of people still have that mindset today where you can only do one thing and you can only be one thing. But no, in this year of 2022, I want you to break that mentality. I want you to multiply. What does it mean to multiply? I want you to maximize on all of who you are. I want to be the first person this year to tell you that yes, you can do it all. If you are a singer that wants to test your hand at comedy this year, listen, this year, go for it. If you are a pastor or you are a preacher and you feel led that God is leading you to, I don't know, start a podcast get uh, on financial literacy, listen, do that, do all of that. I want you to maximize on all of who you are this year. I don't want you to just think outside the box, but I want you to think like there is no box. I want you to multiply. And what does multiply mean? The word multiply is related to the word multiple. Listen, let me tell you, there are multiple ways, multiple avenues for you to be the successful person that God has called you to be. There are multiple streams of income. There are multiple connections, multiple doors, multiple things that you can do and be. You just don't have to stick to one thing. Listen, this year, I want you to multiply. This year, I want you to do it all. I want you to maximize on who you are fully. Listen, if you are a believer like me, then you know that in Genesis 128, the Bible says that, and God blessed them and he told them to be fruitful and to do what? to multiply. Now, I'm not good at math. And now you might be, but I'm not good at math. So, so this, is, this is not about numbers. Now, I'm not talking about numbers right now. So, so chill out, I'm not talking about numbers. I'm telling you to multiply, to be fruitful and multiply. And what does the word multiply means? It simply means to increase. Listen, this year, I want you to increase your confidence. Yes, I want you to multiply your confidence this year. I want you to maximize your courage. Listen, if there is a door that you want open, listen, I want you to multiply and increase your confidence to go knock on that door. If there is a connection, 
that you want to make. Listen, I want you to multiply and increase your courage to go and your courage and your confidence to go make that connection. Listen, this is the year for you to multiply all of the ways that you are successful. And I'm not telling you to go be somebody you're not. No, I'm not telling you to be something that you see out there. That's not what I'm saying. I am telling you to be all of who you were created to be in here. I'm talking about that untapped potential. I'm talking about those gifts and talents that you, that you don't even use, that you don't even know you have. I'm talking about those things, those things that you can do that you are not doing. It is there. There is multiple ways for you to be successful. There are multiple things that God has called you to be. God said, I just don't have a plan for your life, but I got plans for your life. And this year, I want you to maximize on it all to multiply, multiply your desire to learn, multiply your desire to be disciplined so that you can be your most successful self. Listen, this is the year for you to do it all. You can be more than just one thing. And on this first Monday of 2022, I just hope that you are inspired to do it all, to do everything that you desire on the inside, everything that you're capable of, do it all. Every little creative thought that runs across your mind, do it, do it, do it, do it. Again, happy new year. I'm glad you and I made it. Go and multiply and I will catch y'all in the next video. Peace.